Hey guys, it's Heather, welcome back. In today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you an amazing at-home hair removal treatment product that works extremely well. I just finished my fifth week now of treatment and I have noticed a significant reduction in how fast my hair grows, how much my hair is growing back, I am just so shocked at how well it actually works. I've been tempted to try this for a couple years now, but it just seemed like very gimmicky, like it was too good to be true. So I had found one over on Amazon, had like four and a half stars and like 4,000 plus reviews. They were all really, really well. And I said, you know what? Why not just give it a try? And I am just so shocked at the results. So I figured I had to do a video on this because it's something that actually works. So over on Instagram, I've been tracking my progress and just sharing updates with you guys pretty much weekly. So if we're connected over there, you've probably seen the highlights in my stories. And I just kind of go through and track my progress week by week. And I wasn't gonna do a video over here on YouTube unless the product really, really worked. And I thought that it was worth it for me to make a video on. So I'm gonna start by showing the product. I'm gonna explain to you what IPL is. We're gonna go into the features and benefits of the product. I'm gonna do a little demo and then we'll do some pros and cons to make sure I give a full in-depth review so you can make an informed, well-educated decision on whether or not this is worth your time and your money. All right, so here's how it comes. I went with the Braun Silk Expert Pro. This is the one that I saw awesome reviews on on Amazon. It was a little bit more pricier than some of the other ones, but I wanna get something that's actually gonna work and that's legit. So the price right now is I think like $396.12. I'll put it up on the screen, but sometimes it's on sale on Amazon. So it's kind of like hit or miss. You can get money off. I believe I spent maybe about 300. I definitely didn't pay that full amount. So it comes in a box like this. It has the instructions. It has a bunch of pictures and graphics on it. I'm gonna open the box here. This is just a quick guide. So there's some instructions, things like that. Just a little brochure. It comes in a really nice case that you can easily tuck away. It looks discreet, super cute. And it comes with the actual IPL laser itself, charger. They give you a Venus swirl razor, which I already had one. So this will just be extra for me and the IPL itself comes with two different attachments. So this one is a wider one, it's perfect. For me, I use it for like my legs, you could use it for your arms, armpits, and then they have a more precise one, just if you wanna get the light very concentrated, say on areas like if you were gonna do like your upper lip or just something where you needed a little bit more targeted treatment. So I'm gonna put this aside for a second and we're gonna go over what IPL is. I was so confused on this and how it differs from laser. So to my understanding, IPL is not the same thing as laser. Laser is a much more intense treatment. So I'm gonna put a little blurb up on the screen here so that you can read along with me. IPL, intense pulsed light, hair removal technology works beneath the skin surface by targeting the melanin, the pigment in your hair follicle, helping to break the cycle of hair regrowth. The stimulation by the light has a damaging effect on the root and after a few treatment sessions will inhibit the root to produce new hair. So with continued periodic use, the light energy helps prevent unwanted hair from reaching the skin surface. Braun Silk Expert Pro 5 IPL uses our unique SensoAdapt technology to provide safe and effective permanent reduction in hair regrowth. I'll touch a little bit more to explain that concept a little further on in the video. So I just wanted to start by explaining what it was if you weren't sure what it was. Let's go over the claims on this specific device. So it's claiming to permanent hair reduction in four weeks, treat both legs in five minutes, 10 intensity levels. That goes back to what I was just reading with the Senso Adapt technology, which continuously reads your skin and the tone of your skin. And then it automatically adapts to the difference between your skin tone and the deepness of the pigment in your hair. And it goes and adapts the energy in the light for optimal efficacy and safety. That's something that I really, really liked about this one specifically. It's a really good feature. There's also three comfort modes on this IPL. There's three little buttons right here, which indicates which one you would be using. When I first started, I started it with two. I would say start with one. If you want to start with two, don't start with three because you want to see how your skin's going to react to it. And if you're on level three, the setting's going to be higher. So the light intensity and like how it feels against your skin when it zaps. 
So sometimes I don't feel it at all, but then in certain spots, it'll be like a hot sting, like a really quick like zap, like a hot zap. It's nothing too uncomfortable. Sometimes again, I don't even feel it, but sometimes you will get like that hot zing zap. It's nothing unbearable for me anyway. I guess depending on how sensitive you are, it could be different. And there's also 400,000 flashes that this one claims to have. And that does something like, I think it equates to 20 plus years of treatment, which I mean, who knows if this would last for that long, but I mean, you got a few good years to be able to use this, which definitely saves you a lot of time and money in the long run. So the treatment regimen that they recommend to get the best results is the startup phase, which would be one treatment. So one time per week for four to 12 weeks. So if you're not doing this, say every Monday, for four weeks in a row. Don't expect to start seeing results. Everyone's different. I started noticing some results after week three and now I'm on week five and I've noticed major results. So you have to stick it out. Some people it might be four weeks, other people it might be up to 12 weeks. So you have to stay consistent and do it every week at the same time. So then in between treatments, so say you do it on a Monday, in between Monday and the following Monday, the hair that's in the follicles that was treated by the light is gonna fall out naturally. And then the regrowth, so the hair that would be coming out of those follicles is going to be delayed. So the more you do it and the weeks go on, the weeks go on, it's gonna be more delayed and more delayed. So then the maintenance they're recommending is continue your IPL, to your needs, so every one to two months. So I guess you would just tailor your own approach. So if you do it for 12 weeks and you're having really good results, then maybe you wanna do it like once a month, you know, for the next few months or, you know, once every two months, kind of see how that goes. I'm not there yet, so I can't comment, but I would assume everybody's probably different. It's not like a one size fits all. A couple more things and then I'll do a demo and I'll show you all the prep, like how I prep for it and everything, the good stuff that I'm sure you guys wanna see. So a couple other things, this IPL treatment is not gonna work for everybody. I'm gonna put up on the screen a chart here to basically show what your skin tone is and your hair color. So it's gonna be dependent upon what your hair and your skin color is. So for me, I have light to medium skin. Obviously I have dark hair, so there's good contrast there. My hair that comes out is nice and dark in comparison to my skin color. Now, if you have very dark skin and very dark hair, this specific treatment is not gonna work for you. On the flip side, if you have very fair skin and blonde hair or red hair, Again, there's not much contrast there. Your hair is blonde, your skin is very fair, and it's not gonna work well for you either. So the chart should help you kind of determine as to whether or not this would even work for you. Now the fun part, I'm gonna show you a demo. I'll do an armpit for you. I know that's kind of weird, but <laughs> it needs to get done. And it's the best way I can show you exactly how it works on camera. Before you get everything set up and ready to go, you need to make sure that you are shaved. So another thing that I do that I think helps is you want to exfoliate first before you shave so that you're moving any of that dead skin out of that follicle and then you can go in and shave and get the best shave possible. I love the Tree Hut Sugar Scrub. Any scent you like, right now I'm using the watermelon. It smells lovely. And if you've been here a while, you guys know that I love that product. So you wanna get as close as a shave as possible. The reason being is if you have say hair on your legs and it's spiky, you go ahead and use this. All that hair that's sticking out is gonna absorb this light. You want this light to get into the root. So like under the skin, under the surface where the hair is, you want it to get down in there so that it can attack that root, do what it needs to do, and then it'll inhibit the hair growth. I hope that I'm explaining that correctly and that that makes sense to you. I'm trying to explain it in a way that I would understand, so. All right, I'm gonna plug this in. And it does come with a nice long cord, which is very convenient. So this is gonna blink and it's gonna indicate that it is on. So for my underarms, I am going to put it to the second setting. So I just hit the button and you can see that you can hear it. It is turned on. There are two little dots lit up. Now the Senso Adapt technology that I was telling you about is located on the side of the device on both sides. Now, depending on where you are on your body, I'm gonna move it down to here, okay? And it is now at like a six. So it is gonna automatically adapt that light versus energy mix depending on the part of your skin, the color of your skin, and 
what's gonna be deemed appropriate for that area. So this is the comfort button, the three levels, one meaning the least intense, three meaning the most intense. And obviously as comfort goes, one would be you barely feel it when you hit the zapper. If you have it up to three, you're gonna feel a little bit of that hot sensation. This button right here is the button you would press to do the treatment. And then it also comes with glide mode. So to do glide mode, you would hold that button down, hold it flush with my skin, and just slowly drag it, and it would just do enough treatments. It's a great feature for your legs, and it's a great time-saving feature, and it just makes it go very, very quickly. I know I'm gonna get questions about goggles and things like that. It does say on it that the safety feature on it, which is the Senso Adapt technology, which provides UV protection, it's gonna continuously read your skin and kind of adapt the amount of flash and intensity. I would say that if the flash does bother you, do it in the daytime in the light. Don't do it in a dark room. And keep your eyes closed and turn away. If you wanna wear the goggles, wear the goggles. It's not the same as like going and getting a laser done. It's not that intense. I start at the top, push it down, double check, make sure it's on the right setting, quickly hit the button. So do a little pop, pull it down. Get in this awkward area like that and give it a little pop. It's super quick, doesn't hurt. Sometimes you'll get like a burnt hair smell, but that'll be worse if your hair is longer. So on this side, we're gonna do the glide and I'm gonna hold the button down and you can see it just automatically flashes. And that's it. And to turn it off, you just hold this button down. So normally in the summer, I feel like I'll shave and then the next day you can like kind of see it starting to come in. Now I can shave once a week and this that I just did was my fifth treatment. Now I can shave and I could go like five days and it wouldn't even be that noticeable. It would literally be like how it was on day two or three. So that alone is like, I'm very happy with that. So that's the little demo. I do this on my armpits right now, my legs. I don't do it on my thighs because I don't really have a lot of hair growth up there. And then I do it on like my bikini line area. And so far I've noticed very slow regrowth in all sections, but let's go into the pros and cons because I want to give you the good parts and then I want to give you some of the cons about it so that you're very well informed. And I did not mention this, but this video is not sponsored at all. I'm sharing this with you because I've been using it for five weeks now and it's really changed my life. So anytime I have a product that's really good, I think it's worth sharing, I make a video about it. So, all right, so let's go through the pros first. Number one being the convenience of being able to do it in the comfort of your own home. Some people may feel uncomfortable. But first of all, you have to schedule an appointment to go and get laser. Second of all, you know, you're kind of pulling your bikini region over, they're getting in there, it's kind of awkward. This you can do it in the comfort of your own home when you wanna do it at your convenience. It's quick and easy. I really like that about it. So that's a really great selling point about this. So next up is the price for the value. Yes, it is expensive at 396, which is also probably about around the same amount that one session of laser cost. So if you wanted to do full laser, it could cost up to $2,000. With this, you pay for it once, it's the 396, but you're getting the best. According to reviews, and some of the people that I trust their opinion that's used it, they've also had a great experience with it. So I think that it's totally worth that price point, but you can wait until it goes on sale, of course. The next pro for this is that you only have to do it once a week and only takes five minutes. For me to do both my armpits, the bikini area and the legs, like literally, it's it's quick. It's like you're just boom, 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 and you're done. It has that safe feature that I mentioned, that Senso Adapt, so you don't have to worry about getting overexposed to UV, and it's safe and effective. It's gonna be as comfortable as possible. Some of the at-home lasers, I've heard like horror stories of it being really painful. I, I don't know if it was just the person reporting on it, but as I was researching which one to get, I looked at a ton of reviews, I watched a ton of YouTube videos, and that's one of the big reasons why I decided to go with this one because of that feature. Another pro is that you will most likely see a reduction in hair growth. And as little as four weeks, I have like very coarse hair. So I was just so surprised and so pleased at how quickly I was able to notice like sparse areas of growth on my legs. So I could see like, okay, which follicles were treated, which weren't and that kind of thing. So I've noticed that the ones that were treated 
the hair really hasn't grown back yet. And then the last one that I've noticed is much smoother skin, less razor burn and irritation. I've noticed that it's helped tremendously with like chafing and razor burn. So like in the summer, you know, you're in your bathing suit, it's rubbing in that area if you just shaved my razor burn would get so painful that I wouldn't even want to get in a bathing suit. That has been like almost completely alleviated. I don't have to worry about that irritation now and that pain. So and slower growth, less shaving or waxing or whatever you do, and more like flawless looking skin overall. Let's talk about the cons because there are gonna be some cons and I'm not gonna sit here and say everything is perfect when there are a couple of cons. The first one is the price up front may be a bit much. Like, yeah, it's a little bit of sticker shock. Is it worth it if I'm spending this money Right when I could go and get laser and know that the laser is gonna work. Why should I waste this money and buy a device that might be gimmicky, might not really work? Well, you're taking a gamble, which is what I did when I bought this. And I decided, you know what? I wanna test it, I wanna try it out, see if it works. And I was willing to take that risk and that paid off because this one does work for me. Another con is that it does not work for everybody. Depending on your skin and your hair color, it's not gonna work for you if you're super blonde and you have light hair and light skin. Obviously it's a con. I would like it to work for everybody, but it's just, that's just kind of the technology and the way it goes. It, it goes by the light and the melanin and the differentiating factor there. And it, there needs to be a difference in contrast. And if there's not that contrast, then it's not gonna work. Another con is it may be a bit uncomfortable for some people. Some people might be very sensitive. Again, adjust that comfort level. Start with the one if you're nervous about it. And if it's too intense, if it hurts, I'm not sure what the return policy is. I'm, I'm sure I'll look into it on Amazon and I'll see if I can find that. And if I can find that, I'll link it down below. I'll even go on the Braun website and see what I can find. Like if you try it and it's awful and it doesn't work for you, it really hurts. I'm sure they would have something where you could return it, but let me look into that. I'll put it down below. The last thing that I have to mention that I shared over on Instagram, you may develop some red bumps on your skin. So basically like some inflammation bumps where the follicle was clearly irritated. It got inflamed and swollen and those bumps can be very itchy. Like very, very itchy and you're gonna wanna scratch them, but don't scratch them because then you could cause some scarring. So what I found that helps me is CeraVe makes a anti-itch um, lotion that's super moisturizing and it has an external analgesic. It's kind of help with that intense, you know, need to itch because it kind of numbs the area. So you could do either do that or a little hydrocortisone cream on there. That'll help too. If you don't touch them and you don't bother them, they will be gone in a few days. Now, if you are itching them, then the longer you're touching them, obviously the longer they're gonna last. But what I've been told is that these bumps indicate that the hair follicle was properly treated. So that the light got in there, did its job, treated the follicle, that follicle in turn became inflamed and irritated, causing some red discomfort, itching. So it did happen to me now twice and it's subsided in a week. For my legs, I haven't been doing them every week. I've been doing them every other week. It's very interesting. It's only happening on my legs. I'm not getting any bumps under my arms or on the bikini area. It's only happening on my legs, but it's not enough where I feel like it would be a deal breaker. So to me, it's like I can deal with some bumps and a little discomfort if that means that I'm not gonna have to shave all the time and I'm not gonna have to worry about it. My skin's gonna look smooth. I'm not gonna get ingrowns. I'll deal with a couple of bumps. So that's gonna wrap up everything I have for this video. Comment down below. Let me know any of your questions. If there's something I didn't cover, if there's something you want more information on. I will link the product down below. So I hope you guys found this video helpful. I was trying to find a video like this where I could get a better idea as to whether or not this is something I wanted to move forward with. And I figured why not just make that video, do the demo, do the pros and cons, features and benefits, cover it all to help someone else make that decision out there as to whether or not you wanna spend your money and take that chance. So I hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next week. Bye guys.